I think if you go up to London Ranch now, the sky isn't dark anymore. Like, it does that with places that you haven't kind oh, of fixed nice. yet. So, now Lon Lon Ranch is nice. Kakiri Forest is nice again. Um, you've been, like, lifting curses. He's so done with life. <laughs> do this, then do that. Get your bow out. Quick. I am. B. What, what do I have to do? Shoot them. Oh, uh, I'm fucked. Yeah. You gotta get all of them. <laughs> uh... <laughs> It's fine, you did, like, that was really good with the horses, honestly. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I don't know, you can ride it all over, you don't fucking shoot a bow. What is it, is it upgrade your arrow count? Yeah, fuck! Yeah. I'm not even gonna get the money back now, I don't think. Oh, you get a free turn. No! Oh, I might get another free turn there. Oh, fuck. I don't know how you thought I would be able to do this. <laughs> Can't like gambling away all our rupees. <laughs> I mean, the prize is worth it. Oh, come on, come on, no, no! Yay. Have I got all of them so far? Yeah. yeah. Do I have enough arrows? No. Yeah. Yay. Yay. Nice. I can carry <laughs> twice as many Big arrows. <laughs> Look, oh the God. old man is here. Oh my God. Again. What? Oh yeah, this place. What? I don't want to be in here. <laughs> he seems pretty chilled. Oh, it's the Deku Tree you music. So oh yeah. Do I need to kill? Uh, is that, is that your first instinct? Hello. What the fuck? This house of people has been cursed. And they've turned into sculptures. And uh, the more you kill, and the more tokens you collect, you, you return them to normal. So there's there's someone in here, at, at the edge somewhere. Yeah, he's he's been turned back into normal. Really living life. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, he's like, I'm a human again. Uh, well, go talk to him. He'll give you something. Oh. Yay, now you can carry 200 rupees. What that has inside. Wow. So you can actually buy some of the more expensive things now. See, I told you I was gonna need to grind in this game. Is it even like grinding or farming if you're just. Farming getting is like items? recollecting things, grinding is like leveling up. Yeah. Uh, so you're not grinding, you're farming. Look at this sad music. That's like kind it. of bittersweet. Yeah. Why is this rule bad? Like, what's what's so bad about it? There's monsters everywhere. Look, you, you literally stepped there out of the monsters. tower. I started screaming at the scraggly dudes. Yeah, all the buildings were burned down. There's zombies everywhere. There's rocks here. <laughs> rocks. Yeah, but there's monsters before. Uh. Oh, I didn't see that. I like the music. Hmm, that's my favorite bit, I think. Another thing is that, like, we, we, so we recorded, uh, the first half of the first temple yesterday. Um, and then we, we beat it today. When I was a kid, that first temple took, like, probably three or four months. <laughs> like, uh, it's quite quick in comparison. How aggressively was you playing it? I'd be, like, figuring things out and, you know, spend ages in rooms, like, And as a kid, to... like, you only get, like, a couple of hours, like, to play games. Your parents tell you, like, alright, stop doing that now. Yeah. Do something else. Mm. I used yeah. to have three hours anyway. of video games a week. I'd have like, I could either do three hours in one day and then no more video games for the week, or I could do like an hour on Monday, an hour on Wednesday, and an hour on Friday. If you were in this sort of adventure game, you were the hero. Yeah. And you had to have like a song thing. What would be your instrument of choice? Oh, that's a good question. I think I would have something like maybe a harmonica or a triangle. Ooh, a triangle, so you could do one note. <laughs> they do three notes. Do they? Like different sides? Yeah. Is that true? Yeah, that's Fuck what the off, point is. It's not, it's I think true. it's like no, it the whole thing vibrates, it doesn't have different... No, it's true. It's not true. This isn't different to this. 
I'd love it if it was. Like, it kind of was. I'm gonna pitch it's it differently. Kind of. What's he doing? He's rolling away. Harmonica's a great answer. Um, yeah. I almost want to say harmonica as well, but. I'm not a big <laughs> fan of the sound of the harmonica. Really? Yeah. I had like a chromatic harmonica with a slider button thing. Mm. And um, when you would hold it in, it would then allow you to do like sharp notes as well, or like a different scale of notes. Um, and would it that was... be what a professional harmonica would be like? Yeah. I mean, you can still get even more. I think it cost me about £40. Pounds. You have to use a bum Loki. <laughs> Just imagine carrying, lugging around a giant harp. Yeah. A small one, what, like she could be pretty good. Your name is also Beef? That's a coincidence. <laughs> There's not many people like me. <laughs> Especially it's... people like me called Beef. There's a lot of weight when you put your name in on this game. Like, there's a lot of responsibility because it's not just you who will be named Beef. Really? I have an yeah. uncle that looks like me. What's <laughs> the Goron? Right. Well, he's not an uncle, he's just someone I know. <laughs> Why am I a hero to them? Because you defeat seven years ago, you defeated the big king dinosaur. And he was just a baby at that point, so now he's been named after you. That's crazy. Yeah. So I held their little Goron baby and went beef. Oh, yeah. they, they named him after you because you saved the... Yeah. Thing. Oh, that's nice. I really like that. Yeah. <laughs> oh, it sounds like Animal Crossing Town. Oh, yeah. <laughs> his stomach's rumbling. Oh, is that what it is? <laughs> no, it's his arm, isn't it? It's his stomach. Oh. The baby's gonna pop out. <laughs> what would you do? Um, um, ask him if he needs anything. Oh, oh God, I don't have time for this fucker. <laughs> Everybody was taken to the fire temple. What's this? Avatar The Last Airbender? Oh, his dad is the leader. Darunia. Oh. Who's the wife, I wonder? <laughs> yeah. I wanna see. Probably just one of the Gorons that we spoke to and said like, I like rocks. Yay! You got the Red. Goron tunic. Can you imagine one of them wearing that? Uh, yeah. Oh. But they don't need it, they can... Yeah. I guess what it is, it's just fancy clothes for them and it doesn't burn up. Mm. We should yeah. play some Mario Kart racing. <laughs> oh, you like Mario Kart? Yeah, we played Mario Kart yesterday. That yeah. Was fun. Yeah. Yeah. Red. Oh, I don't like it. Dark side. <laughs> you, you need it. Yeah. You can't breathe in the fire temple without it. <laughs> it's not like you can't breathe, it's like, it's like you burn. Well, I assume the oxygen is all like... His, his mouth is still uh, exposed. Go That's right cool. That's a lot of texturing involved. That's yeah. really cool. It looks amazing. Yeah, it does. Very nice. This kid goes through so much. Yeah. And he's like, what do you think he was playing there, huh? I kind of like that um, the Daruni was standing in front of it at the beginning and you wouldn't have known, you know, you wouldn't think that it's a passageway or anything. And it turns out to be, it's kind of like Harry Potter 3. It's like secret passageways. Does this uh, scare you? Yeah, but... My most disappointing movie might have been, um... Uh, the Amazing Spider-Man 2. Oh. I was very excited for that movie for some reason. Oh. Amazing Spider-Man 2. And you hate yeah, it. like the Andrew Garfield one with Electro. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. Um, I I really liked the first Amazing Spider-Man, uh, because it made me nostalgic about the Tobey Maguire ones. Yeah. I didn't actually realize it was shit, but it made me very nostalgic. Like, wow, the, it's this, it's this again, it's this again. Yeah. Um, so like, it the, the nostalgia won over me. Yeah. Um, and I was like, oh man, I can't wait for the second one. And um, uh, I watched it, and, and I, I felt like my smile t slowly turning into a frown oh. as I was sitting in that cinema. I remember, like, I was, in so I, I felt like I want, like, I wanted to like it so much, but like, I was in denial of how much I wasn't liking it. I was like, no, I'm not enjoying this. Oh, oh. Um, and then like. Even after the film, I was like, that was good, right? But no, it was awful. Oh. Um, I can't remember. I feel like I just enjoyed it. Like, I liked the dubstep. Mm. <laughs> oh, yeah. When, when he was smacking that off the thing. So and, <laughs> and it was like in the Spider-Man video. Oh, I'm gonna like fuck it. Because <laughs> it's his birthday. Oh. Yeah. That was cool. <laughs> I felt like It wasn't cool. Only person on the planet who like that, and I like that he almost grabbed the girl, and you see a fucking head smash across the ground. Yeah, that was very like. Oh my god! I don't know the scene. I didn't care about her. No, um, I oh, didn't care about the first song characters. that doesn't repeat again. Yeah. 
you know why you're learning these songs? No, I don't either. They they teleport you to these areas, so like you could teleport back to the forest oh. temple if you want. That's kind of beautiful. This one will bring you here. Yeah. This is nice. That's what these little platforms are with the triangle. This is so dramatic. Yeah. <laughs> this person needs to fuck off. They are. <laughs> oh. Bye bye. Oh. I thought I didn't think uh, he was going to. Oh. That okay. song. That sound is very scary to me. The shout sound. <laughs> <laughs> That's creepy. I always took it as someone what? screaming. That face. It's a little small. Oh my god, you know in Hunter x Hunter when, um, what's his name? Nah, old man. When he's fighting, um, Meruem. Yeah. And he's like drained of all power and he's got that like creepy smile. Oh, yeah. Reminds yeah. Me of that. Oh man. I can't even great. see it that clearly. I'm surprised you guys can. Oh, the power I wonder of not what. Being colorblind. What was it? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, fire. Alright, now we only really need a key. Do you prefer this um, temple than this? To the forest temple? Um. Oh yeah, because it's actually. It's like something new. Yeah. <laughs> Jack I like the... back at you. <laughs> <laughs> I never thought I would see you again. I don't know. I actually don't remember. Like, as we went through the forest temple just earlier, like, it refreshed my mind of how I felt about it. So. Um, I'm interested to see what I think of this one okay. uh, again as we go through it. I was saying to Riz that the forest temple, I feel like they could have made it more like green and foresty. Like there was I, I think a they couple definitely would have improved it. Yeah. yeah. It just felt like a castle kind of interior, like concrete. It just area. felt like caves to me. Like mm. I love the end of this one. I like this one already. It's kind of like, it's very red. It's very like... Um, Can I make that jump? Yeah. You know that you're in. You know straight away that you're in the fire temple. Whereas if if you didn't know where you were going when you went into the first temple, um, if someone was just to guess out of context from a room, I feel like they wouldn't guess forest. Mm, yeah. But with this, you'd probably guess fire. Yeah. Ooh. Yeah, it's much more like this temple is much more like um, uh, embracing its theme. Yeah. Yeah. What what is your guys' favorite moment? Oh yeah, um, I said mine. I I don't know if I have a favorite moment. I have lots of little favorite Ooh. moments. Oh, do you have a free bottle? We do. Yeah. No. Nice. Yeah. Yay. Yay. What happens if you touch him? If you um, do that in this on this. Bottle. Yeah. Oh. And I'd put something else, like another item there, so you don't accidentally use it, because that's always oh, annoying. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Careful not to, like, I, I'd suggest put it away. Like, yeah. Yeah. Slap those nuts on. <laughs> you still got Zelda's note. That's cute. Mm. You got a signature. But you forgot like... how to read as an adult. <laughs> really? <laughs> no. So you can't read it anymore. It's funny that, like, to Link, it's been, like, a few days. And he's like talking yeah. to his, his Wait, younger friends. So he didn't have a childhood. Mm -mm. No. Wow. Can I make that jump? Um. No. I, I reckon either. I need to go up here and jump onto that platform from here. What do you reckon, guys? I reckon you can do it. Yeah. I'm a little scared. But I think if you if you you have to do it confidently. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> nice. That's enough. like ninety percent confidence. <laughs> It's because the, the it's hard to walk straight, yeah. as you say. Yeah, yeah. The port that we're playing, yeah, like, is it supposed to be a wiggly wobbly? No, I think that's the controller. Because this Xbox controller, it has a perfectly round analog stick. It doesn't have the kind of oh, sections. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. So it's probably like balancing Much around more, the yeah. yeah sensitive. Okay. It would be funny if, if it locked my thing. <laughs> yeah. And I was stuck in here. I I don't know if this if it does this or not. I don't think it does, but it'd be good if if you went back to the Goron village. That Goron is there now. Oh yeah, that'd be nice. But um, I mean, they all look the fucking same. <laughs> yeah, but if like if there was one more Goron there. Oh uh, yeah. Um, because right now there's just that one kid. Oh. Oh for fuck's sake. Uh, there you go, same spot. Oh. oh no. No no no. What? Why oh, is that for there? For fuck's sake. Yeah, there you go. I can go up there now. 
I don't know what my favorite part in Harry Potter is. I like lots of little favorite parts. Like, I don't have a favorite part. Yeah. Um, I don't know. A lot of this. Oh, a lot of Harry Potter in general is very cozy to me. I, I think I, just, I like most of it. Yeah. I, I love it when he he goes, um, no thanks, oh, I'm alright. And he holds up the shitty sandwich running oh, yeah. the train. <laughs> and then Harry is like, I'll take it all. And then he takes like a f couple of coins out. Yeah. And then, <laughs> I, when I was a kid, I was like, oh my god. <laughs> That's probably really unfair to all the other kids. It shows how he is just like his father. Oh my god. Um, I have a good think about this. When I was a kid, I found that part so fucking funny when in the second film, um, you know when like Lockhart um, forgets who he is in the Chamber of Secrets? Oh yeah. And he's like, It's not pretty. He's so pretty. Isn't it? Do you live here? And <laughs> yeah. I was like, That's so funny! And I just started <laughs> laughing. Oh. Yeah, that face you... Callum, that's face Oh, Jesus Christ. Did you see that? Yeah, I did. You got hurt like 40 times in, in... Um, go back up, up where you were. There is something up. there. Yeah. Up. Up. But I... I'll give you a little hint, just for... Um, so some surfaces, if you smack them with the sword, they make a different sound. You can bomb them. Oh my god, this fucking shit. It does tell you that. One of the Gorons tells well, I, you. I know, but okay. This isn't Link's Awakening as well. Yeah. I swear to God, I fucking was hitting every goddamn wall. There's a really weird part Didn't make like a that. difference. And I, and, I, and I even tried hitting the wall. Like, I looked up the answer, and I hit the wall that I was supposed to be in. I was like, how the fuck? Like, <laughs> that's not even that... Like, that's not different. I don't understand. Yeah. In, in Link to the Past, there's something at the end that I swear is the most bullshit solution. There's no hints to it or anything. You have to go into the dark, into the dark world, get somewhere else, go into the light world, um, buy a bomb, then switch back to the dark world, go take it to somewhere else, then go back to the light world, and then set off the bomb. Mm. And then that's how you get to the final boss, it's something like that. It's like, how would you... I must have missed something, because I couldn't... Like, maybe someone gives you a hint or something? But I, I used a walkthrough for that, because that was a, bullshit. I had a moment in Wind Waker like that very recently. So, yeah. when you get the Master Sword, um, like, it's not at its full power. Its power is, like... Um, not activated fully. Yeah. Um, so you've got to go. So the king is like, all right, we need to go to the Earth and Wind temples because they're the sages that. And both of the paths for the temples are blocked. Like yeah. One what? has a massive rock in the way. The other one's like blowing wind, and you can't reach uh, the end. So I talked to the king, and he was like, "We should look around, um, sail to Windfall Island." And like everyone was just the fucking same. I was, I was like, "They're just doing their shit." I was like, "What the fuck?" Uh. That wasn't the solution. You have to sail out in the ocean, and there's certain parts in the ocean where a tornado appears, and you have to shoot your arrow three times at the frog. The frog will descend. With the warping song, you have to walk to another specific part on the map, and then with those fire and ice arrows, you have to go to these two separate islands, which aren't the Earth and Wind Temple. Separate, different islands, which are somewhere. Sorry, you have to freeze the fire island with ice, and yeah. melt the ice island with the fire. The iron boots from the other island. And then once you've got them, then you can go to the Earth and Wind Temple, and it's like, how the fuck? Was I supposed to know that? Oh my god.